In many places around the world, the use of one's left hand is banned due to superstitions and cultural beliefs. In 1992, the Association of Left-Handers was formed in India to raise awareness of the difficulties experienced in being left-handed in a country that considers it taboo. From Pune, India, Human Wire correspondent Manjiri Prabhu reports. Dada and Dadi didn't give me food to eat. Sometimes I was hungry. Dada and Dadi didn't give me any work to eat. In many cultures around the world, the use of the left hand is banned for a majority of activities. And left-handers, who form almost 20% of the world population, suffer a lot due to such superstitions. The Association of Left-Handers was formed in 1992 at Pune in India. This is not only the first of its kind in India, but the whole of Asia. The main purpose behind formation of this association was to make the world understand the reality about left-handers and left-handedness. Every mechanical instrument that is being used in the industry is totally designed for right-handers. And left-handers find it very, very difficult using all of these appliances and gadgets. Domestic appliances like an iron often has a cable coming out from the right side so that a right-hander can easily use it, whereas a left-hander finds it very difficult to handle the cable while ironing the shirt or clothes. Grater, grinder, which are to be used by your hand, are designed for right-handed use and left-handers find it very difficult to use them. A simple thing like a peeler is always designed for the use by right hand. Whereas a left-hander often has to peel it the other way, like he's sharpening a pencil. Simple day-to-day -day activities like buttoning a shirt, opening a bottle, to handling professional equipment like camera and computer mouse that right-handers take for granted are actually very inconvenient for left-handers. In Indian society, especially for the religious purposes, left-handers often find it difficult to perform the rituals like worshipping a god to do it with the right hand because in Indian tradition, a left hand is a taboo for using for religious rituals. There are many other factors related to being a left-hander and they start right from the early age of two, two and a half to three. The parents do not understand whether the child is a left-hander or a right-hander and try to train the child to use its right hand for most of the activities, for example, eating, writing and doing a lot of single-handed things. The association wants the society to understand these problems faced by left-handers and to do something about it. The association tries to create awareness about these aspects through lectures, demonstrations, addressing the parent-teacher meetings in the school, addressing to different clubs and gatherings of people at various places. The association has thousands of members around India and many hundreds around the world. Taking inspiration from our association, people from many other countries have formed their own groups or associations. For example, Sri Lanka, Zambia, Japan and Indonesia have their own small or big groups of left-handers working towards achieving some kind of balance for left-handers in this right-handed world. Like the association puts it, let the children decide which hand to use.